Kalimera, everyone. I have just arrived at the Athens airport and I am about to go outside to get picked up by someone and it is a transfer service. The name of the transfer company is Greece Private Transfer and they are, I'm very excited, it was a last minute thing uh, that got planned. Uh, they are taking me on a mini tour of Athens for a few hours today, so I'm pretty excited about that. So let's go outside, meet my transfer company, and head into Athens to see the sights. Okay, I just got into the van with the driver and he tells me that in one hour from now they have a surprise for me, which I'm anxious to see what the surprise is, of course. Um, but So we're going to go for a tour around Af Athens as far as I can tell, so here we go. Okay, so I fell asleep in the, sh in the, in the car and um, we've been driving for about 30 minutes and I woke up kind of in a, in a fog and he told me I could use a, the bathroom in this restaurant so I went in, I'm totally like in my own little world and as I'm coming out of the bathroom I see this. <laughs> So Athens it goes, the Acropolis on the center, and there were some hills. There it goes Phoenix, here it goes the court, and here it goes uh, through Acropolis, it was the first, uh, let's say, ad aqueduct. Mm -hmm. They were gathering water from Imitos. Mm -hmm. When Emperor uh, Adrian came from Rome, uh, Julius Caesar and Octavianus Augustus paid for the expansion of Athens Agora. Mm -hmm. So what we say, what we call today the Roman Agora, it was paid by these emperors, but the Roman emperor who did the most was Adrian, who actually connected the water supply of the city from Parnitha, mm -hmm. and it reached Athens. Mm -hmm. And this only infrastructure was destroyed uh, recently, I mean uh, during uh, Ottoman occupation. Mm -hmm. Until that time, Athens was, uh, gaining, uh, was having water. I mean, this, there are some parts that are still uh, in use. You understand how? Yeah. I mean, you know, Roman infrastructure in all, all around Europe, they were very good. arrived at the Athens International Airport here in Greece and I got dropped off by the transfer company. Uh, I got dropped off by the transfer company, Greek Private Transfer. The driver was very friendly. He was the same driver I had the other day when he picked me up at the airport. Just very nice driver, very nice company. The owner, the communication I've had with him, he's been super nice and friendly. So I do recommend a Greek private transfer. They pick you up in a very nice uh, van. I was driven around in a Mercedes. Um, it was very comfortable, very relaxing. They even have Wi-Fi in the car. 
Um, they, he couldn't have been more accommodating, always asking if there was anything he could do for me, offering me, um, you know, a selection of music that they have in the car and just a very comfortable ride and um, taking you exactly from point A to point B to where you need to go and always getting you there right on time. So I definitely recommend them. And uh, until next time, everybody, don't get lost without me.